My people wonder shall never end. According to what we they hear right now, they said, uh, waiting by Kambirichuku has been exposed. I don't know if you remember Kambirichuku, your Edoche and the May Edoche first son. The one that died two weeks after, uh, a bit two months after your Edoche introduced Judy Austin to, to us as his second wife. According to the information, they said, uh, your Edoche and Judy Austin have been in a very serious relationship for a very long time. You know, Obasi have said it. Obasi said way back then when he put Judy Austin to go and learn, to go and study in Unizik, Judy Austin went there and met Yo Edoche, maybe on one of his shooting, and she fell for Yo Edoche, and she left uh, uh, Emmanuel Obasi, her ex-husband, behind. Although uh, Mr. Obasi was still paying her school fees while Yo Edoche was busy knocking her, you know, uh, and you know that there are some women that whenever you enter into their trap, you will hardly go scot-free. You cannot just knock them and go. And Judy Austin happens to be one of them. Despite the fact that she was married, you know, she started dating your Edoche. And May Edoche have been a serious, uh, hard-working lady. You see May Edoche? May Edoche is a serious, a very big blessing to your Edoche and his family. But some people does not value what they have until they lose it. And maybe because your Edoche was using force on me, and me was condoling it. And he thought that by bringing in Judy Austin, that he would be able to force me, Edoche, to accept it. But it was unfortunate that it doesn't work out that way. When he first introduced to us, okay, it was uh, uh, just lover who exposed it, you know, they said Gislova threatened him. And instead of allowing Gislova to do the introduction, he decided to introduce to us his second wife as Judy Austin, whom he also claimed that they have a son together, Star Dike. And only then, uh, May Edoche did not say anything. The only thing he said was that God would judge your Edoche and Judy Austin. If you remember May Edoche's birthday, few weeks into this, uh, Yo was just trying to make her happy. She wasn't feeling that happy. But because she's not a violent type, she is not a talking type. She was just busy on her own, celebrating her birthday. Then at some point, uh, she started, uh, Yo Edoche started posting good things about May Edoche. How May Edoche is her, uh, his undisputable number one wife. And nobody can drag that position with her. And Judy Austin, on the other hand, will go and comment. You know, she will comment good things, trying her luck, uh, wishing that May will accept her as a second wife for her to come and reap where she did not sow. And because May knows for sure that he wouldn't want to be dragged into polygamy because that is not what Yo promised her when they started this whole jungle. And the, the fact that she had been the one bringing the money, taking care of the family, Doing it that he is growing his fam her family uh, is enough reason for her to say no and stand by it. Because when a woman is independent, she will stand in and stand for what she wants. She doesn't want polygamy. And Yo was trying to impose that polygamy on her. Then what Yo was doing then was Yo will go to Enugu. He will spend time with uh, Judy Austin and Star Dike. He will come back to Lagos. And uh, is it Lagos? Uh, uh, yes, he will come back to Lagos and he will go to the Aja mansion wanting to spend time with May. May will not push, her, push him out, but May will not allow her, allow him into her London because May have started seeing him as someone that is contaminated already. So, and at some point, he was trying to force them into that force uh, me into polygamy and me made it clear that nobody can force her into polygamy as uh, she refused to be numbered you know i don't know if you remember that post so they said at some point uh, me started following it with prayers because uh, she know that judy might be using something to hold her husband they said she was praying hoping that god is going to intervene and they release your 
But something happened. Uh, there, there was a time they said, you will come to the uh, house in Aja. And during that period, May was doing her prayers. Yod would want to have conjugal duties with her, and she would refuse. She refused the first time, the second time, the third time. They said Yod wanted to force her, even to the point that he pushed her. It, it turned into a serious fight. And at that point, they said Daniela and the, the other boy, they were there. They have to start recording him. They recorded and kept it. Okay, it was after the death of their son. And before the death of the son, there is something we heard. Allegedly, allegedly, they said, Judy made an ultimate sacrifice. Allegedly. That according to the story, when Judy find out that Yo wasn't going to, that May wasn't going to accept her as a second wife, she decided to take charge. And you know that for her to take charge, she will be able to manipulate Yo into getting uh, May to do what they want her to do. And that was how they, she, she set out on a journey to Babalawo, to native doctors, to uh, get a solution to her problem, which is wanting to control your Edochi. Then they said the Babalawo told her that the only way she can do it is to bring human sacrifice. And that human sacrifice that she will bring happens to be a virgin. And the number of the person, the, no, the number of the years of that person will determine how long she will be able to manipulate uh, uh, your Edochi, and your Edochi will be under her control. And if that one ends, she, she will be able to renew it. My people, that was how she started considering using May, uh, Edochi's children. You know, when she thought about uh, Daniela, she said that Daniela might not be a virgin again. Don't forget that these are all alleged information, okay? They are all rumored information. So when she considered Daniela, she thought that maybe she's a, she's a girl and she has started going out. The possibility that she might not be a virgin is there. And uh, that was why she decided to use the young uh, the son knowing that that one, maybe uh, he is still a virgin. And knowing that they said that boy is closely attached to me, Edochi, that the kind of love that that boy has for his mother, it is something else. They know that if anything happens to that boy, it is going to shatter me, Edochi, and they decided to use him. He was, she, was doing, she was doing this. She was on this journey with her sister, uh, Augusta, allegedly, allegedly. So when this, uh, they decided to use this boy, they said it was me, it was you that they used to get to Kambli uh, because there is no how they could get closer to him. They decided to put something in your Edoche without you knowing it. They manipulated him, they hypnotized him, and they gave him something to touch that boy with. And the moment he did that, they said after doing that, they pushed him to go to Lagos the next day in order to achieve their aim. And when they, when she, he got there, the boy wo, uh, woke up the, the next morning and told the father he was going to school. They said he laid the hands, he, he lays his hands on that boy, not knowing that there was something they projected and pushed him <laughs> this life. Eh? Let me tell you, whether you believe it or not, a lot of things are going on spiritually. Spiritually. That was how they said they uh, put that into that boy. And when it was time, they, they send it and the thing bring the guy down in school. That was how they ended that boy. Well, before they would rush him to the hospital, the boy don't cry. And that was when it was down on Judy, the, uh, on May, a daughter that uh -uh, this is getting out of hand. And when the father did not mourn the boy with him, with her, she became very angry. And with other things that this the, uh, your Edoche have done to her, she decided that enough is enough. She can no longer fold her arms and uh, watch and watch this woman. Maybe she must have gone to her pastor, and her pastor have reviewed a whole lot of things to her. She decided that she's not going to fold her arms and watch this woman take all her seeds. Uh, it simply means that Judy have used Kambulichuku to do the ultimate sacrifice to uh, manipulate your Edoche as much as she wants. Don't forget that these are all alleged information. Thanks for watching. Share this video. Bye.